Hey guys, Gary Dean, DetailJuice.com. I'm about to start working on this Jeep Wrangler right here. We turned around to 2013. The uh, plan is to wash clay. I'm gonna polish with the newest version of Universal All-in-One with the newer abrasive system for 2021. That's what I'm gonna use. All of my polishes will stay like they are because, well, they work well, but the newest version, so Universal All-in-One has the abrasive update for 2021. And then there's a brand new compound, brand new polish, and then I've got a sanding polish, which I'll explain more about that later. I'm not gonna be using that today, but I just wanna show you guys this Jeep. Full off-road package, it's lifted. Nice winch, bumpers, lights, all that cool stuff. Um, gotta clean the wheels. Suspension, that kind of thing. But that's what we're working on today. So it's getting uh, the brand new Super 7 ceramic acrylics with triple tech coating. The brand new one for 2021. That's what I'll be applying today. So I'm going to go ahead and get set up and get this thing washed, clayed, and wiped down with Universal Clean and Prep. And then uh, I'll bring you back when we're doing some polishing. All right, guys. So I'm, uh, I just got started with the coating Super 7 on this Jeep Wrangler. And as you can see behind me, I have my air injection system. Let me get you turned around. So I got my air injection system. This is a uh, Porter Cable pancake compressor. It works awesome. <clears throat> my second regulator that I usually would have at the gun is leaking and not working properly. So unfortunately, I only have the one. I would normally put this on 80 PSI and run that one at 40, but I'm running this one at around 40 right there so I run this one at 80 the other one at 40 and you always want your filter in there to filter out the line um, and this is just a $15 Harbor Freight HPLV gun and I've got the coating in there um, and I just spray it on uh, if you'll know I am wearing a respirator. Well, I will be. Let me get showing you that. Sorry, I had to clean the had to clean the camera off a little bit. So here's a respirator. You can get those at Harbor Freight. And so I highly recommend you wear a respirator if you're gonna spray anything. So here we go. There we go. Hard to do with one hand, but that's all right. It's on well enough. So I've already can't hear me. I've already sprayed it down with Universal Clean and Prep after Universal All in One. So here we go. Okay, so now you can hear me. You saw me spray it on this whole door and the glass and everything. So it's 
So I like to knock off the bulk. Notice I sprayed it on all the plastic trim and all of that too. So just look at it every dire direction, every angle you can and make sure that you got everything leveled. And uh, if you have any difficulty leveling it out, you grab the Infinite Use Detail Juice 1 with Triple Tech. As that is the maintenance product and the application product, just to make sure that you're getting everything smooth and nice. That's it. All done on that door. I'm going to keep on keeping on. When I get to the other side... When I get a little bit more done, I'm going to go ahead and bring you guys, um, I'll put you on a tripod and let you watch me do it with two hands. All right, guys. So I've got the Super 7 coating right here. My sprayer ready to go. Now how this works with spraying this stuff. Take the lid off your bottle or whatever you want to call this. I've used about a half of an ounce so far. So I'm gonna put another half of an ounce in there. Just put it right inside there. And I'm gonna be bad. I'm not gonna use the respirator. It's so hot, I can't even breathe. So I am going to filter, but with my shirt. So here we go. Let's see what you can see. So we'll do the door. I'll do the mirror and the door so you can see all that happen. So. So, I think you can see that the window is kind of hazy. What you're going to do with that is, the best way to start knocking this bulk off is with a waffle weave towel. So basically I go through, man that stuff levels so nice. And I will wipe the bulk. And you will very rarely get a high spot, especially one that you can't just knock right down real fast and easy. This stuff is so user friendly for how technologically advanced it is. Yeah, as you saw, I put it on the mirror, the glass, um, the black plastic trim. I sprayed it on the Nerf, bo uh, Nerf bars. It's awesome, awesome stuff. Very universal. It works on pretty much all of the exterior surfaces. It's easy to use and it's slammed with technology, which is exactly what you want when you want something that's going to literally decrease the amount of effort you got to put into maintaining your vehicle. Awesome stuff. So you just look at it at all the different angles, check for high spots, and if you see any, you use the Infinite Use Detail Juice 1 with Triple Tech to knock it down. Very similar technologies. The Infinite Use Detail Juice 1 with Triple Tech is different from the Infinite Use Detail Juice 1 that is currently in the 1 system. That will stay, but the Triple Tech coating, Super 7, and Infinite Use Detail Juice 1 with Triple Tech, those you have to reach out to me directly to buy. So that's it. Trim, glass, paint, 
um, powder coat, all of that stuff. Um, can take a treatment of the brand new Super 7. It's awesome. And that's how you apply it. Yes, it's white. Um, I will find a black car to apply to the very next one that I get, which I haven't had one in a few weeks. Uh, but as soon as I get another black car, I will be shooting another video of this spray application. You use far less product spraying it. In fact, one two ounce bottle, uh, which is generally how I sell it, uh, it will be available in 2 ounce and 16 ounce. Um, the 16 ounce will be for large jobs. So big RVs, boats, yachts, that kind of thing um, is where the 16 ounce will come in handy. But it will be available in a uh, two vehicle pack, the 2 ounce. Um, 2 ounces will do two vehicles this size. So I'm going to get back to work and we'll see you guys in just a bit. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this 2013 Jeep Wrangler is all done. I did the full one system package on it. Let's see if I can find some light. Um, I'm over here in the shade. Uh, full one system deal. So I washed it with infinite use detail juice. One diluted one eighth of an ounce to a gallon of water. Um, I clayed with my Japanese clay bar. I also used the universal clean and prep at one part product to seven parts water as clay lube because this had some rust spots, some ferrous metal particles that had rusted in it. So I got all of that stuff out. There's no need for an iron remover, uh, especially in my lineup when you've got IPC, infinite purpose cleaner and universal clean and prep that you can use as clay lube to break down that stuff and the clay will lift it off. So. Uh, I then polished the whole Jeep with the brand new Universal All-in-One for 2021, which is the new abrasive system. It cuts and finishes better than ever before. It's awesome. Um, I've also got a brand new compound polish and a sanding polish. I'll give you guys more info on that uh, very soon. Today's actually the release day in my group for me telling everybody about the sample packages that they ordered a couple weeks ago. Uh, for the new 2021 package uh, products. So today in Gary Dean's Detail Juice Nation, where it's a group on Facebook where we talk about only my products, processes, and what I've got going on, uh, I get to show everybody what's up with uh, all the products and explain them all. So after I polish this thing with the orange buff and shine five inch pad, the Harbor Freight DA and Universal All-in-One, the brand new version, I then, um, wiped down with the universal clean and prep again and then i sprayed the brand new super 7 uh ceramic acrylics with triple tech coating all over this thing which you saw a little bit of let me turn um i hit the tires and the suspension and fender wells with transform dressing I used the new Super 7 coating on all the paint, all the trim, all the glass. It's awesome stuff. Uh, I even took a piece of plastic off. We're actually uh, letting this dry, but I touched all that up, chipped it all back to where it wasn't chipping anymore, and then I touched it up. So that looks good. You can see some of the... I gotta wipe that off. There we go. So anyway, that's that. Uh, I applied the coating to the wheels, all the, the bumpers, front, rear, the grill, the glass, everything. So it looks amazing. And I used one ounce, just, over, just under one ounce of the brand new Super 7 Ceramic Acrylics Pro Hybrid Coating with Triple Tech. Um, so one ounce does a full vehicle like this wheels glass paint trim all of that so a two ounce bottle will get you two of these so that's pretty awesome anyway that's where we're at
Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you guys taking the time to listen to me babble. And if I can help you with your detailing endeavors, 813-846-4406. 2021 is going to be an amazing year. Lots of awesome new stuff stuff coming. Not because I want to add to the line, <clears throat> excuse me, add to the lineup, but because I wanted to make sure that the lineup, the one system evolves in the best possible ways ever. And that's what you've got for 2021. So stay tuned and check out my group, Gary Dean's Detail Juice Nation on Facebook. Let us know if you want to get in there. We'll let you in and there's your Jeep. Thanks for watching guys. Have a great day.